In today's video, I'm going to talk about how some simple changes to that voice in your head can alter how you feel about your phobia. Hi, I'm Christopher Paul Jones, the breakthrough expert. Now, so often when you're scared, when you're fearful, when you're anxious, you have a voice in your head going, oh no, this plane's going to crash, or this spider might be poisonous, or this dog's going to eat me, or everyone in this audience is laughing at me. Now, when you have that voice, it can often have a lot of power over you. And normally you're repeating this over and over again. So what I'm gonna do in today's video is teach you how to change that with not trying to beat it down or replace it with something, just by changing the tonality and the location. So what I want you to do is think about your fear, your phobia, your anxiety, and think about what you say to yourself when you have that. Notice, whereabouts is it? Is it in your left or right ear? Is it behind you? Does it come from inside your head? Where does that voice come from? Just notice that, and what is it saying? And notice the volume and the tonality by which it's communicating it. And what I want you to do is just play with the location. So just imagine moving it from one side to the other, or moving it behind you, as you say that voice in your head, or pushing it off into the distance, having it as a tiny echo of voice going, oh no, the plane's gonna crash, crash, crash. How would that change it? What happens if you make it small now? It's like a, a little chipmunk going, nee, nee, we're gonna crash. Or a Mickey Mouse voice going, oh no, we're going to crash. That's my best Mickey Mouse. And I don't know why that's the international symbol of Mickey Mouse. That's evil genius, isn't it? But regardless, imagine it in a Mickey Mouse voice. How much power would it have then? Or a chipmunk voice, like I say. Or how would it be if it was just, can you think of the most boring teacher you ever had at school that just went, in today's class, we're going to talk about nothing. How would it be if the voice in your head was like, today, um, the plane might crash something with no gravitas or power. How much control would that voice have over you then? Play with that, play with the sounds, play with the location, and notice how much less power. It can almost be laughable. You can't take that voice seriously. Next time you get scared, fearful, or anxious, try it at home. If you like this video, please like, subscribe, and share. Until next time, I'm Christopher Borges.